likely know of HV Tuners as the company that develops automotive diagnostics and calibration tools, but what you might not know is we also have products that work with those tools to enhance your next track day experience. Today we're talking about Track Addict, how to set it up, how it works, and a quick demonstration. Like the name implies, Track Addict is for those who are addicted to tracking their cars, but it's not restricted to only road course racing situations. The motorsports experiences that you can apply Track Addict to include drag racing, off-roading, autocross, and more. At its core, simplified, Track Addict is for race timing, data logging, analysis, and video. It is a phone-based app that supports both iOS and Android devices, available with a free version and a upgraded Pro. The free version simply supports up to three recordings on board at a time and does not have live telemetry, so upgrading to the Pro version is absolutely worth it. Tracked Addict uses your phone's GPS but also supports external GPS devices for improved accuracy. It uses the phone's onboard camera to capture video and has over a thousand tracks supported. You can even build your own tracks if it's not already in there. It's absolutely something that every automotive enthusiast should have and try out. With that, let's get in the car. We'll talk about setup, some tips and tricks, and a quick demonstration. When it comes to setting up your phone in vehicle to use Track Addict, there is one big thing to be aware of to ensure you have the best possible outcome, and it is having a good GPS signal. Most timing and GPS data issues come from having poor GPS reception. So put your phone in a location that allows a clear, unobstructed view to the sky to have the best possible GPS signal. The other thing is you want to have a secure way to mount your phone. So here we've got it on the windshield with a nice solid mount, not only because it gets you the best GPS signal, but it allows you to have a nice view for your phone camera to record the video and also give it a nice stable shot too. The app does have video stabilization, but give it the best shot possible by giving it a nice stable mount. With that, we'll launch the app and play around with some of the other features and functions. To set up your MPVI 2 Plus to work with Track Addict, you're going to want to go to the Setup button and scroll down and you'll see a section for Input Vehicle Sensors OBD. Set up your HP Tuners MPVI 2 Plus. That will work over Bluetooth. So we'll click that, go through and follow the settings. I've already got mine connected so you'll see once this picks up it'll say OBD is ready to go. It's still searching, connecting and we have a connected signal over Bluetooth to gather things like RPM, uh, temperatures, and all sorts of other data that you can gather via OBD and your MPVI2+. When you launch the app, you'll see this home screen with the different options available. We have circuit, segment, drag race, 4x4 trail for off-roading, and raw data, just basic data logging. Going back to circuit, because we are at the Blackhawk Farms Raceway, I'll also show you how you can add different tracks. So we've got Blackhawk Farms and Audubon Country Club. If you want to add new tracks, we could search nearby tracks and scroll through and pick, let's just say we're going to do the go-kart track at Audubon. Yes, and that is added on as an option. The camera button here allows you to see your camera preview, your settings, also select which camera you're using, some basic information. Make sure you are using your phone in landscape mode. If you have it vertically, it will actually give you a warning and will not allow you to record video. It has to be in landscape mode. Once you have that all set up to go, you're ready to hit the track and start recording. Once you're done with your sessions out on track, you go to this folder icon here and you can see all your different sessions. So you see at Blackhawk Farms Raceway, we've done a couple. There's information here and the video can play through also. But now remember, this needs to be processed through Race Render to compile everything from the raw information. So check out Race Render that works hand in hand with Track Addict to complete this entire experience. 